Hello there, this is the Bookkeeping Master on YouTube. Welcome to another free zero training video. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to change the business's name, address, contact details, logo, that sort of thing. It's really important that that information is accurate and up to date for two main reasons. There's probably lots of reasons, but two main reasons. Number one, you need to ensure that Zero has the correct information for your business, for the company that you're working for, just for the sake of having accurate records. Number two, you could be generating sales invoices, statements for customers, and it could be that the address is wrong or the logo is outdated or the phone number is incorrect. It's important, obviously, that those things are right. So what you do is go to the top left of zero, click on this drop down list, and there should be a settings option. So if you click on settings, go to organization details, and in here, you can change the information. So it could be that you want your display name to be demo company UK, and it could be your trading name is demo company UK. Obviously, you can change this to wherever it needs to be. Perhaps the business has gone limited now, so you can put LTD or limited at the end. You can upload a logo. So I've chosen my logo. I'll click Upload. Now I will have a logo appearing on my invoices and other documents. The industry that the business is in, if it's a limited company, sole trader, that sort of thing. Company registration number, description of the company. We have the contact details down here, a postal address and a physical address if they're different. If they're the same, you can just enter one and then click this box here. The telephone number, email, website, and you can add additional contact fields down here, social media and things like that. So it could be you want your mobile number to show as well as a telephone number. This information that you enter will then appear on sales invoices and other documentation. And it could be that this has already been filled out, but you need to come here and edit something because it's changed, such as the phone number or address or even website. www.freebookkeepingaccounting.com. That's my website. Go check it out. We click save. The information is now saved and will appear on sales invoices and other documentation moving forward. Thank you for watching and I'll speak to you in another video.